Then transition to what happens in the West. The next big thing. This is a weekend storm. It starts with Northern California, makes its way really into the Pacific Northwest and then Northern California, you could call it, because we're going to see Seattle get in on this, also Medford, Oregon. The front transitions on Sunday past Northern California, and all of a sudden we're back in it. The active pattern for the West drills the mountains again. So not just rain coming in for the coastal areas, which could be pretty impressive, but also winter storm warnings are back up. That means time we could be looking at the northern sierra getting decent totals let's look at this because of the sierras which have had an amazing story this winter the northern sierras perhaps have gotten the low end the short end of the stick even though they've had great still still good (laughs) don't want to diminish but this could be a chance for the cascades too when the drop monitor came out this week i mean that's what i noticed on it is that we still had portions of the northern sierra in the dryness um not to say that they're they're struggling as much as they were but this is another catch-up for them yeah, that's kind of been lost in our severe weather coverage, of course, as a necessity. But that drought monitor in California, drought just getting deleted from the Golden mm-hmm. State at a very fast rate. This is going to continue that trend as we generate that snowpack, particularly, like you were saying, in the parts of the Sierra. That could use it to catch up, at least in a relative sense. But we've got one to as much as five feet of snow as you move up into the mm-hmm. high terrain. And that'll be stored into the spring as we've talked about all that moisture content. Yeah, and it lined up right there from what you were looking at. And this is a good story for Oregon. Uh, Dylan, if we can go back to the drought monitor really quick, I did want to point out, in Oregon, we have a spot that is still battling drought. That is also coinciding with the part of the higher terrain of the Cascades in Oregon that is actually below average for their snow. I mean, most of the West has been like a slam dunk, but they're slightly below average, and that is an area where it leads into, you know, eastern portions of Oregon where we are dealing with drought conditions. So this is good news for the Pac Northwest. Uh, We definitely do need it in some of those areas. I mean, this next big thing of the storm coming into the West, it's almost like Mother Nature reading the mind. Like, where right. does it, where, where do we, does need, it, where do we need it? I got you covered. Sprinkle it into the spots. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I hope this does turn out to be good news for the West. Certainly will be something to watch. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.